There, I got her. Well, welcome back to another video. Um, today we're doing one of my favorite bites, and that's chasing smallies on their beds. There's absolutely no wind today, and water is pretty clear. I'd say about six or seven feet. And these females are finally starting to push up shallow and get on beds. So I've seen a couple on beds already, and we'll start to throw at them, but it should be a good day. There we got her. That's a nice one. Can't tell if it's the female or the male, but she ate it. No! One thing I really try to do is, when I'm bed fishing, is always have the back to your sun so you're not getting that glare if you look this way. And then if you turn your back, there's an old glare and a lot easier to see. was a fish right here right in front of me Let's see if he or she is still on there looks like there's one got him looks like a male maybe a female That's a nice one. Again, just right on that bed and went to that pink Ned rig and unhook her. Get her right back in there. Nice. It's important when you're bed fishing. I got my tripod set up, my camera ready, and important just to get them back in as soon as you can after you're taking a picture because in that meantime, there could be a bunch of perch and eating the eggs. So you just want to get those bed fish back as soon as possible. There, I got him. There. On that pink Ned rig again. Oh yeah, she's gonna be a nice one. Just come, don't come off. It should be one of the nicer fishes of the day. Oh yeah. Ooh, stay down. She's not ready. Oh, there we go. That was a terrible net job. But we got her. Another probably four pounder. Man, this is fun. Oh, yeah. There we go. I'm guessing a 19 incher. 18 and a half, and on 19. There we go, another nice fish, and get right back. Sweet. There, we got her. 
finally. Took her a while for her to bite, but I just had to suspend that bait a little bit over her bed and she slammed it. I don't know how well I got it hooked, but she is a nice one. Oh, come on, big girl. Come on. Oh, got her. There we go. That is a chubby one. <laughs> that might be the biggest fish of the day. Just had to suspend that tube right over and that finally pissed her off where she wanted to bite. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Must have dropped their eggs, they're not as fat. See how long she is. And about 18 and a half, just under 19. There's another beautiful fish. Look at her. Most of them, females are all on beds. All right, get her right back and she goes back to her bed. There we got her. Stay down. Finally, we got her to bite. Another could be another nice fish. No. There, we got her. Another bed fish and got the bigger one. I think it's a female. There was a smaller male on there. It's probably a three pound fish. What a good average a day, around three to four pounds. Haven't had a true giant yet, but I also haven't seen that many. Goes my, goes my worm. Come on, not like that net. There we go. Jeez, just no. This little fish might be the longest fish of the day. Jeez, round 19. Seems like they all dropped their eggs though. Not much gut to them. Get her right back where she came from. There, I got her. Same thing happened, just spin it over her bed and she smoked it. They're just kind of nipping at it, so I've been losing a few fish. another nice female man they are just all over on these flats with big boulders and just another nice female put her back to her bed and she can do her thing all right let's see if i can get that one i lost
There, I got them. Finally. Don't spit it out. I just can't seem to land it. But it looks like I got a hook, better hook set than this one. There, finally got her. <laughs> that is a chunk. There we go. Lost another Senko, but this another. Oh, maybe high threes. Send her back right away. Thanks for playing. About five different beds within 10 yards of each other and see if we can get one of them to eat. There we got one. Looks like a smaller one. <laughs> Bigger one's chasing it. See if we can drop down and get that bigger one with her. He seems to be pinned pretty good. There we go. Yeah. This healthy fish too there. This one. Maybe not as chunky, but Maybe 17 inch or 18. Let's see if we can get that smoke, that bigger one that was with it. Guessing that was a male, but yeah, it's just really important to get them right back on their bed so you would get other kind of smaller fish taking their eggs. They are just taking the tail of it so I'm gonna try to make it a little bit smaller see what this does got him well that seemed to help to shorten down that Ned rig and he got it in the mouth this time not the big one that was there, but just another good fish. Oh boy. Come on. God, do they fight? He's not going anywhere. There we go. Jeez, just all good fish. There we go. Shorting up that Ned rig seemed to help. Get right back. Got him. <laughs> Shorten up that worm really seemed to help and getting a better hookup percentage now, finally. And they are feisty. Oh. There we go. All this cookie cutters, too. Nothing over 20, but a lot of 18s, 19s. He wasn't going anywhere. Nice.
Got her. Yes. There she finally hit it. This might be the biggest one of the day. This looked pretty nice. Don't jump on me. Female. So another male with her. Yeah, this might be the nicest one of the day. Stay down. Don't jump. There we go. Yep, that's the nicest one. <laughs> that one's gonna be around 20. What a fish. Yes, that's a nice one. Took me a while to get her to go, but she was aggressive and probably the most aggressive fish on the bed today. Yeah, just under 20, 19 and three quarters, I think. But yeah, it was just sitting on that bed and just a beautiful smallmouth. So get her back to her bed. All right, there she goes. Got him. There's another one. Looks like there's another bigger one below him. Let's see if we can get a good look at it. Around three pounds, I'm sure. Just another good fish. Nothing real small today. Not a lot of males out there, been mostly females, I think. There. Yeah, That's a little fish. Please don't get me. There we go. What a day. These things can be so fun when you get on beds and you can sight fish them, but like I said, just gotta be careful with them and get them right back. There is hardly any wind today and it's just making it perfect to glass these rock flats and be able to see these smallies on beds. And you just gotta be able to fish the conditions. That's why I try to, if days are calm, I might go chase after crappies or smallies because you fish with the conditions. It might be a little tougher day for walleyes, so just gotta adapt. Got him. Came back on the same shoreline as I worked earlier and tried something different to get the ones that wouldn't bite and cast it right up on this guy's bed and she bit. It's gonna be a nicer one. Just a great average today of three to four pound fish. He's dogging. Come on. There we go. Just another nice chunky fish. Wow. What a great day it's been. Wow. That's yeah, probably another about 18 and a half, 19 inch fish. And... Alright, we'll get her back to her bed. Takes off a bit. There she goes. Let's see if I can vertical jig this one. There's a female and a male right on it. And they came, got him. <laughs> Man, this is so fun. Not the biggest of the day, but. <laughs> oh, geez. This one might be a boat flipper. Yeah.
He's not going anywhere. <laughs> Go. Top of the mouth. He was pinned. Little scar there. Alright, see you later, bud. God, there we go. Took her a while to bite, but finally got the bigger one. Oh yeah, that's a nice fish. Come on. There. Oh man, she is fat. That might be the biggest of the day. Wow, what a chunk. Just a gorgeous fish. Big old female. Just about 19. Wow, what a nice fish. Seems like that pink Ned rig has been the ticket today. Back on our home, and there she goes. Wow, that one might have been the biggest of the day. It definitely was the fattest. Um, I don't know about the longest, but might be the last one of the day today. It's starting to get pretty freaking hot out. So, well, I finally made it home, and what a day I had out in the water today. Um, I probably boated around 20 to 30 smallies. Um, I don't know if I got them all on camera, but. Yeah, it was a really good average. The top five fish probably averaged around four pounds, and it was just a fun day. Um, got a little warm at the end, so had to cool down a little bit. But, yeah, it was a good day of smallmouth fishing. And But, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, got the boat charged up. Going to head out tomorrow. Not sure what I'm going to chase after. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.